Okay, in this episode. Okay, in this episode, we're going to do some more work on the seals. Uh, we we'll dig the Mark One out so we can go auto testing, and we're going to look at pace notes.
So although it's not a rally, it is only an auto test, just the giggles. Uh, I've drawn out a stage, but Joe here, experienced uh, navigator. Some is experience. He's gonna talk me through how to make pace notes. Yeah. Go on then, so. so the, basically the rule is, this is this is pretty simple as far as the stage goes, but you just wanna note the things that the driver might wanna know about. So, uh, you know, here you've got a keep left. There's a there's a little rock there and a cone, so we'll keep it over the left hand side. This is a medium straight. Got a two bar right entry. You want to say it's a two bar, not just a chicane, because you can go out of a two bar a lot quicker than you can go out of a three bar. Uh, and it's all about the exit. You it's were all about the exit. Yeah. Uh, here you've got a one left, so one's a tight corner. Uh, there is a radius on that. It's not a, a square corner, so that's the one left. Uh, there's a rock there. I've written rock, don't cut. <laughs> Kev, tell the kind people what happened on, uh, on the yeah, first yeah. one. Someone may not have, uh, may have cut that corner with consequences. Yeah, big consequences. And it wasn't even his car, no, poor exactly. lad. Um, here, so we've got a kink left, right. This is down, so I've written down. It's down, it's quite a steep hill actually. That's uh... It's worth the driver knowing it's down. They might not be able to brake as easily. Uh, yeah. Accelerator might end up pushing them on the faster. the difference between like uh, <coughs> a 90 left. So yeah, so a 90 like... has a hard apex. So if you if you imagine you've got a row of cones and then you've got a row of cones, there'll be a cone that's a hard apex for a 90. You probably want a bit of handbrake to get round okay. it. Whereas uh, these, there's a bit of a curve. It's, it's a bend, so you can drive around it. You don't have to worry about going for a handbrake or anything. This one down here, it's narrows, so one left tightens as you go in. Uh, these are medium straight, this is our reversing section for the day. Can't really describe that with pace no. notes, doesn't happen on a rally. This, you turn off right here, that'd be a slot. You don't tend to see that on the single venue rallies, you'll have a split where you do a different yeah. lap, but on the road you might see that, you call it a slot. Well, we were wondering whether to describe this as a, uh, a, a hairpin. Hair yeah, some people might call it a hairpin. I call it a one left long, to be honest, because it's not actually that tight. It's pretty tight, but it's yeah. not that tight. Um, and now everything's basically the reverse on the way back up. So the one right opens. About is some, some drivers or navi uh, navigators like to say about the, the one to six. Or yeah. You know, so some like one to six, so one's tight and six is very open. The others like six is very tight and yeah. one's very open. In my head, as you say, I kind of like the one being tight. and the One's first gear and exactly. six is yeah, yeah. Not, not super fast. I have six gears in my Mini, but <laughs> I mean, it kind of yeah. makes sense for me. It, it, it's, it's what works for you and the driver. You've got to say only a few words. You have a subset of words that you use and the driver understands. And then he's not wondering, oh, what did he mean by that as yeah. you're waffling on okay. describing something? Well, that's awesome. Thank you very much. Appreciate no that. No worries. You need to stick your helmet on because it's your turn. I do. Cheers. Thank you. Cheers, mate.